Hello everyone, this is Aram here and today we are going to create this beading card. I have created this beading card by using HTML and CSS. I haven't used any kind of JavaScript in this. Um, I have seen this in some of the websites. I, I like this style. So I prefer to make a tutorial of how we can create this beautiful beading card. So let's move on to the editor and start coding for this. Here is my editor and I have already a folder in which I'm going to create a file of index.html. I would like to go with another file and this would be style.css. In my index.html I'm going to have a basic template of HTML5 by using my emit uh, extension and here within this uh, title I want to give it a title of heart beating. Okay, now within uh, I would like to link the style sheet. So for this link related to the style sheet, href, and here style.css. I would like to create a section within the body path and the section will have a class of beating heart. I would like to have an ID. And this ID would be a heart. And division, I'm assigning it a class of main. And then I want to go with heading one. And this should be hard beating. Sorry, within this same main division, I would like to go with uh, uh, another division. And I want to have a class of wrap. This is going to wrap everything. So a wrap class and within this wrap class I want to have a division and I'm assigning it a class of heart let's save it and let's move on nothing is happened I'm sure let's move on to the browser first and let me show you that there is only a title and let's move on to the browser sorry editor and start styling it so here in our in the editor let me select a main class i want to have a margin of uh, the left margin i would like to go with 50 pixels and then i want to have my h1 this would be the text alignment uh, sorry for this. Okay. Text align. And the text would be, the text alignment would be in the center. And then the font size. I'm sorry for this. Okay, font size would be 40 pixels. And then font weight. And font weight would be bold. And then here I want to have a my heart class. And this heart I want to give it a position, not position, it's position. It is relative. Now I want to have a heart. And I want to use the sudo class before and again sudo class after. And then here the content for this, the content for this would be nothing. And then left would be 70 pixels. And I would like to go with the top. And this would be 
so and this would be zero position absolute and wait for this I would like to go with 70 pixels and the height would be 115 pixels background I want to go with the right margin would be 100 pixels and auto under from top and bottom auto from left and right now I want to go with the bottom radius bottom radius and this would be 50 pixels let me save it let's move on to the browser and see okay we have a shape like this and now after having this border radius that's 50 pixels actually I want to go again with again 50 pixels left and right and then 0 oops not 9 0 and 0 and let, now let's save it and see okay <clears throat> so we have this shape and now let's transform it transform and use a rotation value so let's rotate it for minus 45 degrees let's save it okay so you guys can see and now let's have a transform property again and transform origin property this would be 0 and 100% now let's move on with the hot after sudo class and left would be 0 transform and rotate and here I want to use a 45 degrees here I have used minus 45 degrees and here I'm just using a positive 45 degrees and I want to go with transform origin this would be 100% and then again 100% let's save it go on to the browser Ooh, our heart is ready so we have created this heart now let's uh, make it like this like a background and a, the bearing the, or these animation properties so let's move on to the editor and here let me bring everything here in the middle of the screen and now let's use a bearing heart class where the background would be black and then the color of the text would be white and the height sorry G -I -G -H -T, height would be 100 view height and then I want to go with the padding and it would be 50 pixels and then 10 pixels let me save it move on to the browser and let's see okay so we have a title with a white uh, with white color and the heart is still here so now let me move use my wrap class here and the wrap here I want to display it uh, as a flex so we know flex flex and now I have a align items property and this would be center and then justify content and this would be also center and then align self align self is also center and padding for 
this would be uh, let me use padding top this would be 40, uh, 50 pixels and let me save it okay so we have our heart here and now let's use the animation and for animation let me have my heart class and for this let me use animation or let's create animation first so for the animations I have to use the keyframes for that add key keyframes pulse I have used this pulse uh, animation in one of my project if you guys haven't watched it you guys can see that I've used it in a but for a button pulsating button and I'll give the link in the description below of that project it, uh, it's a restaurant website project you guys can see if you haven't watched it and transform and now I want to have a scale this would be one now I want to have it on 15% And on 15% it would be the transformation for this. So I mistook here. It is transform. And the scale at this point would be 1.25. Let me bring it here. Okay and then i want to go with the 25 percent and again the transform property so transform and here the scale would be 1.15 now i want to go with the 50 percent or 35 percent And the transform property for this and scale CL scale not like this I'm sorry scale would be like this and here I would like to give the scaling of 1.25 again now I want to move this and I want to have a 50% and for 50% again the transform property the transform property and for the transformation here i would like to go with the scale of two and then let me bring it here so again this would be 100 percent and for this the transformation for this would be the scale and one let's save it i'm sure nothing is happening um, because let, let's use this animation property here for the heart heart class so here i want to use this is the name of my animation so this pulse class i'm going to use here this name sorry and for one second and infinite and that's all let's save it move on to the browser wow so it is looking beautiful and it is looking nice too and we have done it by using HTML and CSS we haven't used any JavaScript I hope you guys like this video if so do hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe to the channel I'll see you next time with another interesting video hasta la vista ciao ciao